If the ratio of HIJ to triangle DEF is 3 to 2, draw a triangle DEF. And we'll also find the lengths of sides DE and EF, which is going to be so fun. So let's set up the ratios first. All right, this is triangle HIJ to triangle DEF. The reason I've done this is only to show where, what values I'm going to put in each numerator and denominator as I make these proportional. So that is a ratio right there between triangle HIJ and triangle DEF. And we can simply write that as a fraction. Now it says that uh, HIJ is this 3 halves. So it also gives us another fraction, which would be that ratio 3 to 2 which was given in the problem. So we just need to make it equal to the parts. Now let's go into that diagram and look at see the lengths. So on triangle HI, we see that this length right here is fourth, four. So HI is four. On the other hand, we have IJ, which is this length. And if we counted those, we would find that its length is eight units right here. What this does is it helps us to establish a proportion, uh, and then we just fill in the missing values. HIJ, triangle HIJ, well, these values go in the numerator. HI in this letters right here is corresponding with DE. So we want the side DE, which we don't know its value. But we knew, do know the length of HI, which is 4. From here, you may use any, va any method you want to solve for the length DE. I would use Fishy method. So I would have my four values. I would multiply, then divide, and then equals 4 times 2 divided by 3 would give me the length of DE, which would be 8 thirds. Here's the length of DE. So in the graph, I will make this a length of 8 thirds. So I'll make my first point D. And uh, 8 thirds is about uh, 2 and a third. It's 2.6. Uh, two, no, yeah, 2 and 2 thirds, I apologize. Which would be right about a count. So there is my E. And I would connect those two points. Next, I'll take those same ratios. I've got three halves. And this should be equal now to a separate, different ratio because I'm now looking for side EF, which is part of triangle DEF, so it's in the denominator. And its corresponding side on triangle HIJ is 8. If I use the same method to solve, I have 8 times 2 divided by 3, which means that EF has a length of 16 thirds or about five and a third so I need to go into that graph and graph it so from E I will go up five and a third one two three four five and a third maybe about right yonder and that is my uh, F I just connect those two then I connect these two and behold I have my diagram of triangle DEF and the side lengths as well here. So the reason we know that the triangle we're drawing is smaller is because the HIJ is in the same position as the 3 in the ratio. DEF is in the same position as the 2. 2 is smaller than 3 so we know this new triangle DEF will be smaller. The final thing I must do is write my answers where the answers go. The length of DE was 8 thirds, and the length of EF was 16 thirds. That's a better 6, something like that.